Hi YouTube, I'm back to share with you guys some uh, the way I package my Valentine embellishments. So um, I've had a Valentine series. I have like five videos sharing different Valentine embellishments. If you missed those videos, I will link the playlist below so you guys can check it out. Um, but I'm on. I'm in a one-on-one -on -one swap with Jane. She's one of my really good crafty friends, and so. We decided to do a one-on-one -on -one swap, and I just wanted to come back, as I promised, to share with you guys how I'm going to present some of the embellishments that I created. Now, I couldn't get everything in here. You can see how bulky this book is, but I got most of it in there, um, and I wanted to share with you guys how that all turned out. And then at the end, I'll share with you how I packaged everything up. And I was actually inspired to... Um, put my embellishments in here because I saw a video from CPR here on YouTube. She had um, like a photo book and she had like a, a lot of different die cuts, you know, from SVG files and things. And she put it inside a photo book. And I was like, oh, that's a really good way to give, you know, to your crafty friends um, embellishments or die cuts or something like that. So that's how, what I wanted to do. And this is how mine turned out. Um, I just put some paper here, you know, in the heart of this book. And this actually comes from a gift bag. It has Happy Galentine's Day. I just cut up that gift bag and placed it in here. And so, yeah, that's how that turned out. I didn't want to do a whole lot. Um, like I said, when I give to people, I like to keep options open. She may want to do something else with the book. So I didn't want to overcrowd it with a lot of stuff. So... Uh, yeah, so let's go to the first page. Um, kept it very simple and clean. And I just put her name here. And, you know, I made this for her. So I just, that's all I did. You know, I wanted to keep it real clean. And so um, here's some of the embellishments I made with the cute dog um, and the little picket fence there. And I think this really cute. Let me fix this up a little bit. Some of them I put like little dimensionals on the back to keep it in place, but I didn't do it on these because they were already really bulky. But you can see how that turned out. I put some paper inside. These pockets are four by six. So here's the next set of embellishments. And like I said, you guys check out the videos and I'll go, you know, I go more in detail um, in those videos. So I'm just sharing with you how they look all put together those embellishments these uh, here's some tags and some of this stuff I didn't share on my YouTube channel I just put it up on Instagram and here's a little um, what do you call it memory decks card and sorry for the glare you guys but it'll take too much time for me to take them out and then this is something that I just had in my stash I created some time ago, and I just thought I would gift it to her. So I just stuffed it down in there. So, And then I just included some doilies and another cutout I had. Just a great way to, you know, gift some things that you've cut out. Here's some more die cuts I gifted there. Here's my Miss Piggy SVG file that I cut out, and I just put it on there. I used some washi tape, and then here's some tags I created. And then here are my bag toppers. Put in here, and here's my Betty Boop bag toppers. And then here's another bag topper with Mr. Love Bug. And then I just included some cutouts that she can use for some projects, you know. I just think these are some printouts that I had. And so I just thought it'd be fun to give, you know, some of the printouts to her. So she can use these for some cute Easter projects or baby cards or whatever she chooses. I put some of these um, Valentine um, printouts. And some of these and something for Easter some more something for Easter and then this is one of a die cut um, from one of my dies 
I just thought it'd be fun to gift that. And then she has all this extra to play with so she can add things, you know, to this book and use it. So she got a lot of room in here. So, yeah. So that's the book I wanted to share with you guys. And then I'm going to come back and share with you how I'm going to package everything together. Okay, you guys, this is everything packaged up. I just decided to use this box from my stash. I love boxes, and you can really get some nice boxes um, during the Christmas after Christmas sale. So I picked this box up at Target during the after Christmas sale. And all I did was added um, the little Valentine ephemera pieces. I just added them on top of the box and that was it. I wanted to keep the packaging very flat. Um, so, you know, I don't have any problems with shipping. So, here are all the contents inside. I put some fun confetti. And you can pick this confetti up from Target at a really good price. And it has the gold um, confetti in it. And so, it's really, really pretty. I love it. So, I just filled it with confetti, put everything inside, and yeah. And so, here's a card that I created. I think it turned out super, super cute. So, yes, you guys, that is the swap. I had so much fun with this swap creating. It was just a whole lot of fun. And I hope my partner likes what I created for her. And thank you guys for tuning in, and make sure you... Join my YouTube family if you haven't all yet already by subscribing and hit that notification um, bell to be notified of my videos and check me out on Instagram. And make sure you always do something with love and passion. Bye!